I hope, of course, that I can reach the record of uh, Nicole, but um, this is also another dream. Well, yeah, like uh, last World Champs was uh, was amazing for me. It's uh, it's always the tournament I wait for, and always the the tournament that I want to play my best squash. And uh, yeah, I think I was uh, I was playing with the whole tournament, and uh, like Nurana and I have been battling for a long, long time, and not only in the finals of the World Champs. So. Um, uh, it's it's good to be in this uh, rivalry with her and uh, being the number one and number two. It's uh, it's tough for me and tough for her and uh, yeah, it's uh, it's challenging and I like this challenge and uh, yeah, like uh, I don't think that uh, we're the only two challenging against each other. There's many many players that are really good and uh, we have many tough matches now from the first round. So. Uh, so you always try to look step by step and uh, yeah, it was one of the best memories for me to win the World Champs in Egypt and in, the, in one of the best venues we had the last year in the museum, so uh, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, it, it means a lot and like, as I said, every, every player, their dream to win the World Champs, so uh, yeah, winning three of them in Egypt is uh, uh, it's a pleasure for me to win any tournament in Egypt in front of your home crowd and in your country and uh, everyone's watching, so it's, it's extra special. Um, yeah, having six World Championships is huge and uh, I never thought I'm gonna win six. I always wanted to win the World Championship, but I never thought I'm going to win six World Championships. So uh, it's huge for me and uh, uh, it's, they're all the, the best memories I'm going to live my whole life. Uh, remembering them, each and each tournament is special, each tournament is different and has a different situation before. And, uh, and yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look back to them and be very proud and, and very happy. Uh, I'm, I'm still playing, I'm still going to an, another one, so uh, I'm, I'm gonna, I hope I'm going to be ready, I'm going to do my best, I'm going to be the same preparation for, for each tournament. I'm not, I'm, I don't always do something different before the World Champs, it's still the, I just set the goal every, every year when it's the tournament, but still I still have many platinum events I need to win, I need to play, so uh, I go as if it's a, another platinum event uh, as the others and, uh, and just I go and see what's going to happen. Uh, well, it's, uh, it's definitely in my mind, but uh, I don't think of it like this because uh, I'm not, I don't know what I'm going to do in the next few years. Uh, definitely I will be playing squash, but I don't know how I'm going to be performing, how I'm feeling. Uh, uh, I'm not gonna be the same every year, but uh, still, uh, as I always say, that I, I take it step by step. I take every year and every tournament step by step. I don't look that that uh, that long, or I don't I don't look that far. So uh, I just I'm just gonna focus on the next one this year. I have it the next month in May, so I'm just gonna focus on this. Uh, I hope, of course, that I can reach the record of uh, Nicole, but um, this is also another dream. Uh, but like everyone is talking that, come on, this is the next step. But for me, it's not the next step for me. I just want to focus on the, the seventh first. I don't know if I'm going to win it or not. I will try and I'll do my best, but, uh, but I'm not looking that I'm going to win the eight or nine or ten or six or seven. No, I'm not counting. In counting them, I just go step by step, I do my best and of course I hope I win the tournament but uh, just let's go step by step, it's, it's more comfortable for me and uh, no pressure, no stress, just uh, try to relax a little bit.
But I, I don't change things in training because it's already in the middle of the season. Every year it's in a different timing, but it's the middle of the season. You don't have like a month or two uh, uh, training for the, for the world champs, but you have tournaments, you've been traveling, so uh, you don't have a lot of time to, to be prepared. So you're already being ready from, from the beginning. I just, at the beginning of the season, I, yeah, yeah, I plan when, when is the world champs. I try to pick at this time. I try to be, uh, my body's okay. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I, haven't, I have nothing wrong. Uh, I'm, I'm, my training is going well, nothing in my mind. And uh, just be focused and, um, and just, just be ready for the tournament. Uh, and yeah, I, w I try to be mentally ready and, uh, and clear-minded, so I have nothing in my mind than this tournament and uh, the match. And I go there, I just always just take it match by match and, uh, and, and that's it for me. But of course I, I, I always want to peak at this weekend. Uh, well, yeah, it's amazing to have him in my team. Uh, I try to balance the time between uh, being with my coach uh, in Egypt and uh, and the, ha the other half with Greg and Frog. So, uh, yeah, just to have to uh, the mix between them and stay as well. I have the, my whole team back home, so I have to train with my fitness coach and my squash coach as well. Uh, and I really love the, the mix between them. Uh, they talk a lot and they try to uh, get everything along and uh, it's, it's amazing to share different thoughts together. And at the end, we're, we want the same thing, we want the same goal and uh, we're working for it, all of us together. So uh, yeah, it's, uh, we've, been, we've been the whole season together now and we're, we used to each other, we used to the places, the courts, so how we're thinking, what we want to do. So uh, it's, it's good not, that we're not going to try each other in, in the tournament or in the World Champs. We've already been to different tournaments together and uh, I trained with him many times now. So uh, yeah, it's just amazing to have him in my corner. He's, uh, he's very determined and very passionate about squash and, uh, and very experienced as well. And, uh, I'm learning for him a lot and uh, and I think it's it's working so much with me right, right now and uh, it's helping me a lot so uh, yeah I just I hope keep going like this and uh, we'll see how it goes <laughs> I just wanted to have something new in my team, something different. Uh, I wasn't very happy with my, my results the, the last season. So I just wanted to see what's new, what I, what I could change. And uh, once I, I talked to Greg and let him, he watched he watch me a lot, a lot, a lot. So he started to analyze and see what, what I'm doing wrong and what I, what I should do. It's just small changes that can make a huge difference. and. Uh, and he starts to get along with my coach as well. Uh, so I just started to talk what, what, I'm, what I'm used to do and what should I do and what should I change. So uh, yeah, in, in the beginning it took, it took him a while to, to start to watch the women game, start to watch me and uh, to see what, uh, he's always like more interested in the men's and that's just normal. But <laughs> once we talked, like he started to watch the women's game and uh, see what I should do and um, and yeah, we started working together uh, straight away. I hope you're seeing it like this. I lost a lot of finals before winning the first <laughs> Windy City. <laughs> lost, I think, like three finals and the three of them from Ranim, I think. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I, and I failed a lot in the Chicago, so I think it's time to rise now <laughs> there. So uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy that I already won two of them in Chicago. And uh, yeah, I think I'm, I'm playing good there now. Uh, I, I'm, I'm comfortable with the, with the venue, with the people, people's vibe there is amazing and uh, yeah, I, I'm loving it now there. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, as you said, it's a rivalry that's been going for a long time now and uh, I, I believe that every match has a different situation and you learn from every match winning or losing you learn 
from it and uh, I, I think we're all the same but it depends who's better in this day so uh, I learn from the match I lose and I learn from the match that I win so just just I'm okay that I'm, I'm in this level I'm happy with it I'm definitely trying to to do better try to not lose a match but you're never gonna win all your matches so you have to lose matches uh, and this is where you learn and how to get to get over this feeling over this matches and uh, it's 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 tough every time playing one of them so um, yeah and I'm just I don't know I'm the, I go with this match uh, with my game plan I do my best and uh, and that's it and yeah this season we played against them I won I lost from both of them so uh, I can't say that I'm losing all the matches against them. I'm, I'm winning as well, so that's uh, that's fine. Uh, so it happens, and uh, I don't know, but it's good to have this challenge and it's good to have this rivalry, and uh, it's good that we're still going together for hopefully longer time. And uh, I believe there's upcoming players as well. They're very good and very challenging, so it's not gonna only only be the three of us. It's 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 more than us now, and uh, it's good to have them own in. Uh, well, I feel a huge difference than last season. As I said, I wasn't happy with my results last season, as I only won the World Championship. So uh, yeah, I'm feeling really good. Uh, I reached I reached almost every final this season, in all the platinum events. So uh, yeah, I'm really happy with my performance and. Uh, just want to push uh, a harder push the last three tournaments and definitely the World Championship and uh, it's the, the upcoming one. So um, yeah, my body is good. I uh, feel I'm mentally and physically in a good uh, place and uh, yeah, I, he I hope it's, uh, I, keep, I can keep going the same thing until the tournament.